Hi guys, welcome to the Global Skills channel again. We have a, a great video again for the Google Bypass. So this one is an LG, as you can see, it's an LG MS 428. And this is a new method and it works 100% as we always do for the other videos as well. So first we're gonna, I'm gonna show you how to do hard reset for this phone. You're just gonna press the um, volume down button power button and then once we see the logo you're gonna just release this one quick and then press back again and then it should reset let's do it and press hold the volume down hold the power button and then there you go and then we click on it there you go so once you see this logo right here uh, they're asking erase all user data and restore default settings and then we scroll down with this to yes press the power button to select yes and then here asking um, all user data and restore default settings click yes to start yes and then this is how we select power button select okay so now it's start erasing everything so make sure if you do have any pictures or files that's important to you guys save them on a memory and then you can start doing this hard reset once it's hard reset i'm gonna show you how to bypass google account so just stay uh, stay with us and we'll show you step by step okay so once the phone turns on we go next right here and then skip if you don't have a sim cards on and we go enable the internet here is you're gonna see all the wi-fi that you have around you so you for myself this is my wi-fi i go to it i'm gonna put my password for you for your case you just put the password for your wi-fi if you do have one if you don't just click and you know click connect so in my case i'm just gonna type the wi-fi connection password click on ok now it's connected there you go it's connected skip and then we go back okay so uh, you just click on accessibility right here click on it and click on yes and then after that we go to vision and then click don't click on this side click on run the middle right here there you go I'm just gonna go back so I can show you do not click here click in the middle right here so once you click scroll all the way down you're gonna see text to speech output click on it and then you see this logo right here it's like a setting logo you just go and then click on it and then after that click on setting for google text to speech engine click on it and then go all the way right here feedback click on feedback it's loading and then after you see this feedback we go all the way right here to privacy policy you see it click on it there you go we are on google already so click on accept and continue and then here uh, do you want to add an account okay so no thanks go next okay so we go to this bar right here click on it and then we're gonna type frp dot f zero i l dot com so the address i'm gonna uh, write it in the description below and it's F as in Frank, R as in Robert, P as in Patrick, dot, F as in Frank, zero, I as in Ice, L as in Larry, dot com. Click on go. There you go. We're going to click on step one. And then we go all the way right here and check this. And then we go to Gmail and we're not going to click on it. We're going to press and hold. Okay, so look, 
press and hold I'm just gonna do it this way press and hold there you go okay so once this one is open we go to not notifications right here click on it and then we go all the way to app settings app settings click on it and then we go to those three dots all the way right here click on it and then you will see this list we click on manage accounts the top one just a click and then we go continue so when it's continue okay so we go all the way up right here where you can see the three dots click on it and then tab view if it's showing like this we're gonna click on it again on the three dots and then we're gonna click on list view okay so once we click on list view you see we go all the way to security and then as you can see right here unknown sources are in are disabled so we cannot uh, you know enable this this one even if we click on it so I will show you how to do it okay so to enable it we're gonna go ahead to verify apps we're gonna disable this one and then we go app to phone ad administrators click on it and then we're gonna disable it and then here they're asking us cancel or deactivate we're gonna deactivate it okay and then we go back go back after this one we go to apps right here click on it and then we go to those three dots and then we're gonna click on show system scroll down all the way to setup wizard right here you will see two the there is one like a blue or purple and there's the green one so we're gonna go to the green one setup wizard click on it and then we're gonna click right here force to stop click ok okay so after this one is done once we click on force to stop we go to storage right here and we go to this one clear cache click on it go back back okay then we go back well we scroll up keep going keep going and so you see google sorry. Google Play service and Google Play Store okay so we go to uh, play uh, Google Play service click on it and we're gonna click on disable click yes and then after that we go back and then force stop okay and then on this one we just keep going back 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 keeps going back all the way there you go and just we're gonna click and do restart power off and restart click on it okay after the phone turn on we're gonna go next and remember guys we had the Wi-Fi connected before so what we're gonna do we have to do it a little bit quick once you click on next and then we go to that Wi-Fi that you had and then we're gonna click uh, forget so next skip if you don't have a sim card we go to the to the internet enable it and then I go for my case to this one right here we go click and then forget so there is no internet because if you leave the internet connected it won't go through so we go next skip anyway okay so you go next that's if you want to put your name for my case I'm not going to I'm just gonna go next uh, that's if you want to put like a pattern or like a passcode to connect I'm just gonna disable it skip skip anyway 
agree and then done all right guys the phone is already like restart successfully and you can see the home uh, page again so what we have to do now uh, we'll hold the top and scroll down so you can see all the notifications as you can see right here enable google play service and enable google play service we have to disable those two uh, options if we leave them on you won't be able to load any of your applications so we go next enable so we, can, we have to disable it so click on enable there you go and then we go next to the other one and then we're gonna enable both of them sorry i said we have to enable not disable them so disable this one okay so guys make sure this one is have to stay disabled okay so when it's disabled just go back both of them disabled so everything is working perfect so as you see guys all the time we bring you the best videos on google bypass and all this one are very legit and honest and we do it live so you guys can see the whole steps sorry if we are not you know explaining ourselves the way how we should but if you do have any question you can just leave the comments below i'll be you know uh, more than happy to ask them as soon as i can and please do not forget to give us a thumbs up because that's help us a lot to you know bring more videos to you guys and share with your friends if like you know one video of you guys can you know if you share it with your friends that can bring us more viewers to the videos and then that can help us to do more videos and like the videos uh, if you have any questions leave a you know a question below in the comment section but please you, we do have a lot of viewers thank you guys for your support and then always give us a thumbs up and share thank you and see you soon